I'm not one to do extended reviews, but I had a company contact me and say, hey, you want to try our Wild Badger Power 26C Straight Shaft 4-in-1 multi -two Tool multi Heramenta 4-in-1? And I said, well, sure, I'll try it. Here's the crazy thing. I've had a, a uh, John Deere XT 140 far I know for a fact 15 years not only that I think it's been longer actually like 20 years and I have put one spark plug in it in the entire time I've owned it I've never had a minute of trouble with it and all of the sudden it won't crank it sparks i even went a step further and put my finger on it to make sure it would spark now i know what you're thinking this looks like stuff you'd see at i gonna be honest i can't believe they sent it to me i guess they really expect me to do a reel on it I mean a, a video. Well, I'm going to. Not only that, my youngest offspring is currently in the landscaping business. He's an individual entity. Okay, it's all about you, isn't it? Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm just kidding. That's my dog right there. So anyway, the weed eater died. My job here. And it is an XT140, old as the hills, but ran and purred like a kitten. Now I'm hoping that fuel filter isn't just sitting around in the tank and I have to run the lines for it. Hang on, I gotta hold it up to my face. No, it's hooked to it. I saw it done in there. If you're familiar with weed ears or trimmers, one, there's your bulb, of course. One line is the overflow and one is the intake. And when you squeeze this, it sucks gas up in there. Well, you need a little filter on the end. So there's your standard issue choke. Not a choke, that takes the cover off. Dude, read the directions, I ain't about to do that. There's start and run, so choke and no choke. And what other options do we have? It looks like a Lowe's trimmer, on and off. The cool thing about it so far that I see is it does break down into smaller pieces. I have never owned a trimmer that comes apart where you can hook other pieces up to it. Simply because, I've got good reason, and you'll probably agree with me, the main reason I've never owned one of these is I've never bought one. That's actually tightening that way. So it comes with a tree trimmer. And it comes with a little chainsaw. You little badger, you. It appears clear. It has its own little oil tank. So that's cool. Things you don't need with a trimmer is that. Or that. Or that. Or that. You only need this. 
I'm thinking we're in the zone. We're about to go throw some fuel in this monkey and see if she chews a banana. The ultimate test is going to be how much this head can take abuse. But that appears to be similar, similar to most of them that go on any trimmer. It doesn't appear to be doing much. Oh, never mind. That goes on the, uh, the thing that I said I'm not using. That doesn't appear to. Oh, it works. Okay, that's tight. Oh, that's just on there so it doesn't fall out and you lose it. There, now we know how to do it. Let's go put gas in. Shouldn't need that. Shouldn't need that. Proof that I have not been stretching the truth is here is the XT40. Brand new spark plug. I thought that would fix the fix. It didn't. What did I do with the old spark plug? I gotta get a cleanup system. There's the old spark plug. And this thing has ran forever and ever and ever on that. But it's had some abuse. I'm still gonna put it back together. And uh, probably buy another carburetor for this one. This is 25 Credence Clearwaters. And this is a 26 Credence Clearwater. We're going to see. This one is balanced beautifully. Now the biggest difference is right off in the... The only difference... Let's take it down to bare bones. I do like that. Chokers look identical, don't they? I mean identical. Put it back the way he found it, dude. Okay, don't get all mad about it. I know it looks bigger over here. The actual muffler's right there in the same place. That is this cage. This just go back, just goes back a lot farther. I wanna know if you really love me. I wanna know. I forgot how this goes on here. That got to hang on. I just simply had it upside down. Oh, that's really nice. Because before, I got to put the cover on there and put a screw on. It's not a big deal. But, so there they are. This one appears to have a shaft that's a little bit shorter. You know, I may use that after all. I may go back and get that, but I want to see if it runs first. I won't tell you what I was doing a minute ago. I was looking all over the thing for a spot to put oil in it. Then I remembered. This thing's amazing. It's the best John Deere mower I've ever owned also. I know they make them bigger and they make them stronger and they make them wider. But. You're supposed to do that. That's when the lid hangs right underneath there to catch the last drops of the strawberry margarita. Are you ready? Give it a little pufferoni. I love it. Sounds like a little bird. One, two, three. I know that's not the choke. It's in a different spot on that one. Sorry. Choke. Start. Okay, it's autopilot all the time. Okay. Oh, it's you're saying it's that new. It's pretty 
balance, it's kind of twisted to the right a little bit in my hand. Turn your car off with your foot, bruh. It also appears to have a little, little bit bigger fuel tank. No, it's just an illusion. The John Deere is a little fatter and taller, and the Badger is a uh, little bit slimmer and longer. I'm excited about it. The only thing I've, I have bought a fuel cap for this. And it did roll around on the trailer and break this special cap off. The cap did nothing but hide that hole, which is the same thing that cap does. When you're old, first thing you do when you buy anything or testing things, you do this. <laughs> Plastic. I remember my day, everything is made of metal. This can't be a piece of metal. Got a dog out here somewhere. I can't find it. Here's a good girl. You know what? One person, one thing I never wanted to do was start the "Who's a Good Girl" thing. Where's my dog? <laughs> I gotta develop this whistle. I was supposed to be taking a nap right now. It's like one in the afternoon. I should be in full nap mode. There's just things to do, like this tree is falling down. It will be a most tragic day when that hits the ground. We've got black vultures living over in one of the trees over there now. I haven't seen my dog in a while. I'm just kidding. Who's a good girl? Not only does she have her own couch, she has her own room and her own house. There's nowhere for her to sit right now, so you gotta go up there, go. Faster. Good girl. I just remembered the point on why I actually ended up using these is because of that. I used to, before I had a guard on the other one, used to just use concrete to trim it, but this is the way to go. So now, that one has the screws out there that just simply screw through, and you take that, either or either that, because he's about to be here and gonna do it himself. I've trimmed around a lot of small stuff. I know it's hard to see with the sun in your face. And uh, it's done fine. My only issue with it is my John Deere spool. When I let off the gas, it'll go zzzz. This one is almost like it has a break on it. And I did oil it, or extra oil it, right here. I just don't like the way it stops. You gotta give it, you gotta give it a pretty substantial amount of gas throttle pedal whatever else that's grass and spider webs to keep it spinning so I decided I would show you what I'm talking about we're gonna hit the tallest weeds I haven't cut in a while you're not gonna hear anything but the weed eater so it is absolutely incredibly easy to crank 
I bought it with my tongue. The line is not strong either. But okay, here you go. Example of the throttle. I know it looks good to you, but if you ever use a, an expensive weed eater trimmer for those of you who just got triggered, it free, it free, free spins easily. Six credence clear wires will do that for you. I'm gonna show you something. That right there is so hot, it hurts. So when you're holding it, if you're like me and you give your elbow the guidance to push it and move it around it is hot i know they all get warm but that one i've read reviews i read a few reviews after i got this and it said that is the problem so i will probably try to find a high heat something and wrap it around that other than that this thing works pretty doggone good that's got a mountain of dirt in it or i would cut it but I've never done a full review of one thing in a video. I usually do other things. This stuff is Pope Salad Annie. And it is strong and it cut through it without a problem. And I was just whining about the quality. Oh my goodness. Of the uh I want to fish desire poke salad annie there's probably bugs all over it they'll eat it and then it'll float back to the side and i'll pick it up next time so that is a full view of the weed eater part i'm not going to hook up the chain to show the chain because you get the same power of course you can't cut trees down but you can cut limbs the other thing simply a head trimmer you know how a head trimmer works that's it. This is the, what looks like a Husqvarna with a wolf on it, 
That is the WBMT26P Badger. I'm trying to check fuel consumption. That's about as good as it gets. I'm absolutely pleased with it. It's like 199 bucks for that and all the other stuff. But I'll put the uh, I'll put the uh, link and uh, anything on your eyes. And if you're interested, and I'm not getting kickbacks from this company for showing it to you. They simply sent it to me and said, "Hey, do you want to show this on your channel?" And I said, "Sure, that'd be swell, Cinephilus." And they said, "Okay." I know you're wondering why I don't trim all this because there's a dog right there. Sometimes it acts like it doesn't know me, but that's all part of owning a dog. But uh, I know that's the uh, common behavior for a cat. We were talking about something. Oh, but if you use my Amazon link and buy this, I think I do get 32 cents point zero seven. And if you use that link and go in there and decide you don't want this and continue shopping, I'll get a little percentage of whatever you buy. Come here, I want to show you something. Come here. What's your thoughts on it? It's blue, like University of Kentucky. Look, it's got a dog on it. Did you see this? Come right here. Thanks for watching my videos.